Okay, it's a differentiating question. Um, we're asked to find what values of x is this uh, function an increasing function. So increasing functions, or which part of a function is increasing, now as this is cubic, it's a negative cubic, so it should look something like this. Okay, now increasing function means it's going up, but for most of this function it's going down but between this bit and this bit the function is going up and then the rest of it is going down. So we're trying to find um, whereabouts in here it's uh, it's actually increasing where the, where the gradient is positive of the function. So essentially what we've got to do here is to differentiate it to find the gradient function that tells us what the values are of the gradient. So we want to work out dy by dx of this so divide by dx of 150x, well we just reduce the power by 1 which makes x to the 0 and times by that power, so 1 lots of 150, so that's just 150. And then differentiating 2x cubed, we reduce the power by 1 to make it x squared, that power comes down and multiplies by this minus 2 to make minus 6. So that's our um, gradient function, and we want that function, because we want it to be increasing, we want to find out where that is greater than 0. So where it's a positive value. Okay, so um, it would help if we could um, factorize this function. Now, what we can do is we could divide throughout by an, a number here, or we could be a little bit more sophisticated and factorize out a value. Um, so I could divide throughout by six, and uh, six is into 150. Are going to go not 25 times. Or um, more technically correct would be to take the factor of 6 out to leave you with 25 times x squared is greater than 0. And then from there we can factorize the 25 minus x squared because that's a difference of 2 squares. That's 5 squared minus x squared. That's going to be 5 uh, plus x times 5 minus x. Um, and we yeah more more properly we should write like this okay so we want to find out when that's greater than zero so um, because this has an this is a, um, a minus x square graph x square graphs look like that so a minus x square graph looks like this. Okay, so if we find the two values where it crosses, where it equals zero, which is where these two these two are equal to zero. So when x equals five, um, five in this one, and actually let's do it the right way around, where x equals minus five in this one, that equals zero, and when x equals five in this one, that equals zero. So between minus five and five, this gradient function is bigger than zero. So um, where x is between minus 5 and 5 um, then that's a gradient function. Actually we don't want the equal sign because we, when it's equal to 0 that's not an increasing function, that's a stationary point. So we want it between minus 5 and 5. Okay, and those values will give you a positive gradient and therefore an increasing function this part of the equation.